Hey, Arthur. Good to see you. Why? You want rescuing again, do you? <laughs> no. I got a plan to make it up to you. Oh, a plan like the Blackwater Ferry job, or like you going off scouting and ending up in jail? <laughs> Dutch said you was a, a big shadow cast by a tiny tree. I don't even know what that means. Mm, I thought you was a tough boy. <laughs> Not one of those gentlemen trying to protect his riding clothes. Well, I just know whenever things get real, you turn yellow and lose your head. Yellow? Sure seems that way. So I guess you won't be riding with me to rob the banking coach comes about this time in the strawberry. I heard one of the O'Driscoll boys yapping about it while I was inside. You and me? Do a robbery? That's what I said, didn't I? After you. <laughs> There's a spot up this way with a good view of the trail. What are you doing anyway, camping out here like some crazy hermit? Can't exactly stay in town now, can I? Like I told you, I ain't going back to... Dutch without a peace offering. So what's the deal with this coach? What do you mean? Comes through about this time every day, like I said, the end. I mean, how many men, guns, riders? Nothing serious. It'll be fine. I heard the bank's been hiring every trigger man they can get of late. The meaner, the better. You worry too much. Forgive me if I ain't wholly faithful in something an old Driscoll told you when you was half drunk in a jail cell. He kept yapping about it, saying how they've been hitting it on the regular. That's a good lead in my book. Damn old Triscolls are everywhere now. Bastards got a hold of most of Big Valley. Heard they took over some big ranch north of here. How the hell you and Lenny end up down here anyway? Oh, you know how it is? A few loose ends, drink here, drink there. What loose ends? Nothing that needs to concern you. I always pay my share. It concerns me when you put us in danger and we don't realize till it's too late. Like that move you pulled in Strawberry. Making me kill half the town just for your precious guns. Precious they are. You need to roll a little looser, Morgan. Looser? I've seen you come full undone more than once now. And you've only been running with us a few months. Are we gonna rob this coach or bicker about it? What's done is done. Guess we're robbing it. Then let's do it. on this ridge. Hold! They should be here in a little bit. Hold tight. Which way will they be coming in? Should be from over there. We need to hit them fast before they get into town. Well, just don't lose your head this time. Of course, tough guy. <sighs> they should be here any minute. Look, there they are. Right on time. Get covered up. Come on! <laughs> Ride! Yeah.
is fun for you. Hurry, get up. I'll drive. No need to keep your face covered now. It's just you and me, sweetheart. I'll give it to them. They put up half a fight at least. Yeah! Stay luck! Come on, boy! Hmm. Here. Find new rifle, too. Here you go, Arthur. From me to you. That's more your style than mine. What did I tell you? Like licking butter off a knife. Something like that. You don't want to just break it open here and be done with it? Could be more than we can carry. And there might be a second crew of riders tailing. All right, then. Not to mention, we ride back in with a big take and a new wagon to boot. Dutch can't say we ain't pulling our weight no more, can he? I ain't sure I trust this new act of yours one bit. Listen. I know we got off on the wrong foot, but I got no beef with you. I reckon we're a lot alike, you and me. Now, hold up there. Dutch knows I'm a feller that gets things done, same as you. Get things done. Shit! Now we're being robbed! Get across the river!
show them. Why is it every job I do with you ends in a pile of dead bodies? Since when did you have a problem killing the Huh, huh. <laughs> You've got a point. That should do it. Come on, let's see if all this was worth All I see is you, me, a river full of dead O'Driscolls, and a lockbox. I'd say we're golden here, Morgan. Look at that. What's the cut here? It's good. Just make sure the gang gets its peace. Yeah, yeah. Like I said, big shadow, tiny tree. And like I said, that still don't mean nothing. Now get out of here. Go see Dutch. Make sure you ain't followed. I know, boss. I know. It's been fun!
hear no more of this. I won that game fair and square. Shit! Fair! Your move! Who else want some, huh? Sure, I'll shoot you. I wouldn't mind some practice. Well, let's get to it then. Oh, Oh, do come in. Well, I use this space as a blacksmith, too, so... Let me know if you need me to grab something for you from the catalog. Uh-huh, go ahead. It doesn't hurt to stock up on ammo. You never know. You want to make this really yours? Give it a personal engraving. I'm looking forward to testing this out. Thank you for your help. This your way of stretching your luck? What's with you then? So, feeling better? How's the scar? I heal pretty fast. Lucky you. So you just lazing about, or you got any leads? I got something. You see them? Sure. Well, you see yourself as a shepherd now? <laughs> Maybe. Come on, come along. You'll see. That train job was a start, but we need more money. Until we can get back to Blackwater and collect. 
What are you waiting for? Anyway, you were saying? I'm here to tell you. We try to collect that money anytime soon, it'll come with a noose. I was worried you'd say that. Dutch says that we... Dutch says a lot. That's his gift. Saying things. Oh, yeah? What do you mean by that? I was a prize pony once. Now I'm the workhorse. Listen, Dutch is... But... But, well, you was at that thing in Blackwater. We already seen Pinkerton's here. New century's coming. This life, this way, well, we're the last, I reckon. And we ain't long for it. Then that's the way it goes, I guess. For me, yes. All right. So where are we going? Just need to pick up something. post over there. Tether the horse and I'll meet you across the street. I already don't like how this is going. Gun store? Yep. Can you, uh, head in, pick up a sniper rifle? I'll explain later. Don't you wear yourself out now. Oh, well, hello again. How can I help you today? Looking for a rifle? Something with a sight on it. Shouldn't be a problem. You want to see what we've got? It's all in the catalog here. Sure. Let's go. Hi. Why couldn't you have done that? Done what? Bought that gun. I had a run in with that fella earlier. We ain't on the best of terms. You had a run in. I've had a run in with half that town. Calm down. It's done now, ain't it? Why are you being so cagey about all this? Always playing some goddamn game. Me? I ain't the one taking Jack on fishing trips. No, you ain't. If you say the boy ain't yours, what's the difference? You probably only run off again. Why are you so interested in my life? Ain't you got one of your own? Just do one thing or another. Not be two people at once, that's all I'm saying. It ain't that simple. You know that as well as anyone. Same as with you and that girl... What was her name, Mary? That was different. No, it ain't. Just the same. Anyway, for the love of God, will you tell me what you got me doing here before I turn around and hit the breeze? There's a herd of sheep coming down to auction from Emerald Ranch. Folk in town were saying the owner's trying to stamp out every farm from here to Ansburg. Yeah, I know that place.
to the ridge up there. Get a proper view. This way, Arthur. So I'm thinking that the herd will make it to auction all right, but a couple of new ranch hands will be collecting on the sale. Doubt the town will care to notice too much. Why we need this rifle you couldn't buy yourself. Reckon we shouldn't get too close. At least not till we know what we're dealing with. Let's see what we can see from up here. Okay, I think that's them over there. The one now? Put a shot in near them. I reckon they'll hightail it. They're only ranch hands. Just watch the sheep. <laughs> yep, that spooked them all right. All right, let's go round them up. Let's go get the strays. You ever work on a ranch, Marston? No. You? Oh, day here or there, but not much. Most cowboys I know are dumb as trees. How hard could it be? I guess we'll soon find out. Let's get these things. Bring them back to the yards. Scattered. Let's get them all rounded up. <laughs> Easy now. You ain't helping. Yeah. Ooh. All right, I think we got them all. Let's head to town. You know what? Why don't you leave the sheep to me? You ride Shank, keep watch for any trouble. I brought you in on this. It'll be quicker this way, trust me. This ain't the right time for you to be learning how to herd. All right, whatever you say. I'm done arguing. <laughs> uh, uh.
Those are up, boys. There you go. Fine sheep. They're okay. Well, you seen better around here? I've seen ones with less ambiguity about their provenance. <laughs> A lot less. What are you trying to say? I'm trying to say you give me 25% kickback and I won't say nothing to nobody. Everything all right here? Excuse me? Sure. I'll excuse you for 25%. Do you want me to put another hole in your head? Folks swing for rustling livestock. 25%. 15. 20. 18. Done. Calm yourself, friend. Just think of it as I'm buying your sins. Uh, you're buying. We're paying. Go on now. Come back after the auction. You'll get your money. Dutch is waiting for us at the saloon. He is? Thought we was doing the robin. Still good money. Well, thanks for all the help with this. <laughs> can't herd, can't swim. Give it a rest, will you? We ain't kids no more. No, we never really was. Get going, girl. Come on, sunshine. I'll buy you a whiskey. Not everything, but in the end, I don't believe in absolutes, just shades of gray. Compromises. Compromises. Well, I have never been a man for compromises, and I fear at my age I am too old to ch uh, Gentlemen. Dutch, Lebo. Where have you been? Working. Marston's thing. Good. And? We're just waiting to get some pay on a few sheep. Leopold, my good friend, as long as you're here, why don't you and John go make sure there ain't no funny business? Of course. Gentlemen. Drink? Sure. <clears throat> Nothing like talking to old Strauss to make you want to blow your own brains out. I should have left him where I found him all those years ago. Bookish little Austrian, fresh off the boat, his eyes out on stalks. Well, I guess the Dutch Vanderlyn finishing school has some strange graduates. That it does. To your good health. Thank you. Vanderlyn! Get out here! Get out what here the now! Hell? You don't know me, but you keep robbing me. My name is Leviticus Cornwall. I am not a man to be messed with by the likes of you. Get out here before I have these men killed. What do you think? Get out here, well, I... you depraved piece of trash. You start spinning a yarn. When I think the moment's you right, I'll make a move. I got where I am by letting Why not? you rob from me? Vandalin, you're done. Now get out here now. Deal with this nonsense. Please, gentlemen, this is a terrible mistake. This is a case of mistaken identity. What is worse than admonishing a man for the sins of another? Who wants to be the Messiah? Not me, nor do I want to be this Dutch Vanderlyn, whomever he may be. I am Archibald Smith, a lay preacher. For God's sakes, Arthur, will you get to it? You 
Let's get out of here. You make sure nobody's following us. We'll get back to camp. We're gonna gather the troops and get them to start packing up. Ugh. Sure. We can't stick around after this. Let's go! <laughs> Get out of here. 